and grow YouTube show. In terms of why this is important, I just feel like in society right now, it's just like, it feels like we've never been so overstimulated and our nervous systems have never been so fried. Everyone yeah. I talk to is experiencing burnout. Everyone I talk to is experiencing imposter syndrome, self-doubt, um, extreme transition. I think everybody in the last couple of years has been forced to go through some form of extreme transition. Mm -hmm. um, and everyone, it feels like everyone's tired and flailing and like looking for some simplicity, you know? Yeah. And yeah. I feel like plants are the answer to that. I agree. I, I mean, I agree with you so much. I think that you know, we were talking when we got started, we were talking a, a little bit about trauma and that we're yeah. at a place now in society where we can recognize that we all have trauma. And not only that, we all have shared trauma. Now, of course, the yeah. way trauma plays out for each person is different. But the truth is that every single one of us has experienced some form of trauma. And in the last few years with COVID and everything that's come with it, that's been a shared trauma that we've all experienced. And in some ways there's a blessing in that because it's created a space for us now to have these very important conversations around trauma, around emotional intelligence, around wholeness and wellness from the standpoint of the physical body, the emotional and mental body and our spiritual connection as well. So I think that we're having deeper conversations right now. And I think that's mm -hmm. very, very important. When it comes to trauma in particular, there's so much that goes unsaid still now, but it doesn't go unsaid in our bodies. We yeah. may not speak it out into the world, but our bodies hold on to that energy of trauma. And unless we learn how to move it from our bodies, it's an energy that we're still carrying around with ourselves, And when we're looking at it from an energy transformation perspective, when we're filled up with older stagnant energies, it's very difficult for us in that moment to receive the fresh energy, the fresh prana that's constantly being sent to us from earth and from source energy as well. So, we have to learn how to allow energy to move through us so that we can continue to open to receive an energy that promotes a bit more wellness in our life, a sense of more movement, a sense of more ability to adapt and flow with what's happening in our life. <laughs>